We are living in this time where visual communication has taken on a new way of interaction. Whether you are a student presenting a class poster, an emerging business person, or a celebrity on social media, you need some basics of graphic design. Graphic design involves typography, photography, illustration, and such subsets. And recently, it has become an essential component for your projects and for business. Hi friends, I'm Hadika Maksud, and today I'm going to introduce you to an amazing graphic designing website that is free and effective. Talking about students, we have been working on Word, Excel, and PowerPoint all our lives. Now we have tools that are quicker, more appealing, easier to follow, creative, and much, much enhanced in visual quality. That means you can be an engineer, a doctor, a lawyer, and still have graphic designing skills. So this video is about Canva, a designing platform where you can literally design anything. Be it posters, cards, letters, book covers, Instagram posts, Facebook posts, YouTube, resumes, and more and more and more. Canva is an Australian company founded in 2012. I discovered Canva a year ago and I became a fan on day one. Let's give you a quick tour of this amazing website. This video will be an overview of it. I'll just quickly cr also create a small post for you. However, I am doing some tutorials on Canva where I'm creating a resume, creating a poster, and those could be really helpful for you and you would see how quick and easy those are. Now, let's go to canva.com and here you can create your account. Once you've done that, you would see this as the home page. Now you can see you, it just says you can design anything. Now let's have a look at some templates. Here you have hundreds and thousands of templates on different topics and uh, they are actually categorized. So for social media, personal, business, marketing, or education, you can just go about and design whatever. Uh, let's go and design a poster and we have this page and look how amazing there are. There's so many options that you can choose from. There we go. So you would actually have all of these cards and letters and posters in their specific sizes. So you don't have to tailor the sizes, which is the best part about this website. If we go back to the menu, we have an option discover and you would see that Canva offers free photos, backgrounds, there are icons of social media, web that you can use and there are printing options. So with Canva, you can actually, whatever you have created, you have an option of printing it out. So here we have design school where you have courses and tutorials so you can actually just learn every step of designing for whatever needs you have be it marketing or branding just social um, media components so let's just go and see for tutorials now we do have canva for education we have branding with canva presenting with canva and I'm going to quickly show branding with Canva, like here. There are just two videos and they are three minutes each, so you can have a look at what they are telling you about branding with Canva. Now let's have a look at courses, and this is one of their impressive parts. Like here you see five classes and you can see the number of students that are enrolled and that are learning from it, and there is a separate course on social media mastery, there is learning the basics, and then branding your business and so on. Let's go and have a look at the basic one, graphic design basics. So if you're new to designing and new to the graphic design concepts, I think this is where you should start from. Having a look at the courses, we see 12 lessons on the right side, and then you can see that there are videos on each of these lessons, and then they are actually giving quite basic concepts of what, what are shades, combos, fonts, and so on. And as you progress, you can actually go ahead and do the other courses where you brand your business or you some for, for, for teachers and students, you can do the presentations and use Canva in your classroom. Now coming to the last 
option in the menu bar. Canva has a free version and then there are some paid options. So in the free version, we have more than 8,000 templates. We would get hundreds of designs and um, options to choose from. So this is pretty good for individuals and for like class projects and for teachers who want to introduce more creativity in the classroom. And if you are a bigger team, if you want to go ahead and be more professional in it, then there is like a pro version and then there is an enterprise version and they are monthly um, based. Now let's create something together and then you can have a look at how the designing layout looks like. Okay, let's say I want to make a, an Instagram post. All right, this is how it looks like. You would see right away on the very top you have templates options. So there are all these templates that you can choose from. You can even click on one and then edit it accordingly. That's one of the easiest and quicker ways to do so. But if you want to start from the blank page, you can start with the photos. You can um, add elements in it. So let's go and use a template. Now, let's say I choose this post. It says, be your own motivation. Now, I like the design of it and the typography, but um, I want to change it with the words that I want to use. So I'm going to write designing with here and then the other font, I'm just going to change and make it Canva. Now I will overlap this a bit so I can just move around by clicking it and then there. All right. Now, one more thing is that you can actually change the color of your background. So you can choose from red, yellow, whatsoever. And then from here, if you want a new color, you can choose from this bar and change it accordingly. Now, let's say I want something like a teal color. Okay, we're done. But it looks a bit simple, so I want to add something more, maybe a couple of elements or text. These are lots and lots of elements in terms of shape, frames, charts, lines, um, some nice, nice graphics, and so on. Do keep in mind that there are some elements with, which are freely available, and then there will be some that are Pro, okay, let me show you an example here, hand-drawn love. So if you click here and you see that this heart with Happy Mother's Day has a watermark. And then if you hover on this one, you would say it says Pro, which means it is available if you have the subscription as Pro. So we're not going to use that. We will delete it. And then let's go and see some free options. Okay. I want to add an organic rainbow. So I click here and then I can see lots of these options for a rainbow. Let's go for something like this. Okay. I can just make it bigger or smaller. The best part is I can change every single color within this rainbow. So let's see. I am going to add some colors. You see how it just changes so you can just go ahead and do some clicks and see which one works for you, which one do you like, and there we go. So, all right, let's say if I want to add some text. Now, you also have these options of having a template, so you can add a text just the way it is showing, or you can just click on one of the options and then remove the rest, whatever you don't want, and leave what you want to keep. So I don't think I need more of text. The other options are of videos, which are also freely available. And then background, if you want to change your backgrounds. Now, let's say if I want to add another element and that could be a simple draw an object and I go for maybe like three dots here and just place them here. So let's say this is my final version. What I would do is I would download it and then Canva will show me the options of file type and then the suggested one. So PNG is a high quality image that is suggested for an Instagram post. You can have it in JPEG. 
you can have it as a PDF and so on. So let's go ahead with what I have and just download it. Preparing and there we go. We have successfully created an Instagram post and it was so easy to do. So how I mentioned there were templates for every post and social media content, you can actually create your own dimensions. My first creation on Canva was a bunch of cards. So I just sent hello and appreciation cards to my friends all over in the US, UK and Pakistan. I did this to get familiar with the tools that are available on Canva before I can actually go on and do some professional work. Also, my thumbnail of this video is also created on Canva. I hope this video was helpful. Do check out this website. It's really helpful and it's very easy to use. Show the creativity in your class, in your business, among your colleagues, and then see what a difference it would make when you are delivering your product or a project. If you like this video, do consider subscribing and do look out for my next videos on Canva where I'm creating resumes and another one where I'm doing a poster. Thank you, signing off.